documents. Uh, uh, Rahul, please go ahead. Is this a freedom of press issue? Is this uh, is this a, a transparency of media funding issue? Is it a, a anti-terror issue? Is it a India-China issue? Is it shades of all? It's a mix of all <clears throat> and many, many issues. So uh, let's uh, sort of disaggregate it. It's impossible to look at it in, as there's just one case. There are several uh, dimensions to it. One is the question of funding. Uh, if UAPA is involved, then I agree <coughs> with both of them that criminality and not simple criminality, but anti anti-national, anti-national criminality, conspiracy, and uh, terrorist activities have to be established. We have no, no uh, information uh, leading to or pointing to, po pointing to those activities on the part of uh, NewsClick and its promoters and journalists. The second is the question of uh, the journalists who were working there mostly as consultants. This, I'm told, was the legal status of the all these journalists, all our friends who were there hosting their programs and writing for it. They were consultants. They are not. They were not full-time workers. Even if the money was illegally funded or in the, in the, had come into NewsClick illegally, even if it wasn't declared as uh, FDI funding into a media company for which there are norms and 25%, uh, I believe, is uh, the norm that uh, can be invested in a media company in India. Uh, was it done uh, under, under those laws? Was it declared? If not, then why not? Secondly, the police have to establish then, uh, whether criminality of an anti-national nature, actual acts have taken place, or there was a con incontrovertible proof that there was a conspiracy for anti-national activities. Mm -hmm. That would only, only that would justify UAPA. Yeah. The question of journalists comes, arrives when, whether they knew that the funding was Chinese funding, Chinese in source, the a source which is, uh, which all of us knew was dubious, to say the least. After the New York Times report, every one of us knew that there is something fishy about this source, about uh, Singham and his company. Uh, I have just realized it uh, when a friend pointed out that uh, I've been supporting uh, my friend so far, but I've just realized and I've raised it, written it, that they need to clarify whether they knew that this was Chinese funding whether they knew that they had read the New York Times report and after they had read the report and they become aware of uh, the dubious nature of the funding, did they raise it internally? Did yes. they, did they, uh, and, the, the, and they need the to only justify thing we have from, the only, Sorry, the only thing we have from them on record today uh, is a statement saying we did not take editorial instructions from Neville Singham or from any Chinese entity. Uh, that is their statement, but they have not, I do not, they have not actually spoken about the 38 crores that has been published in the media received over three years, according to media reports. I have no independent corroboration of this. They have not told us whether this entire amount came from Mr. Singham. Uh, and, and there are leaked emails purportedly, but we do not know the authenticity of those emails. So there's a lot we simply do not know. Sorry, Rahul. Go Just ahead. last point. Just last point. Yes. yes. In my personal opinion, for any journalist to work on a platform where they know that the funding is Chinese, that too from a dubious source, which has been internationally sort of known now because of NYT report, for them then to uh, continue to hold programs and uh, host uh, to, to appear on that platform, they need to clarify and to justify it. Knowingly doing so, in my view, editorially as a, as a journalist, is inexcusable and indefensible. I don't question their, uh, their commitment to journalism. I don't question their patriotism at all. They are all very fine journalists. They're all friends. But they need to clarify this question. So you would I like to hear from the, to, you would like to hear from the contributors as well. 
Yes, you don't care about news click, but the individual journalists who once they That's knew right. about the Chinese link, what what was the internal debate? कुछ सवाल पूछे होंगे क्या जवाब मिला किस बुनियाद पे उन्होंने वहाँ पे काम you know they continue to work there. That this is a question coming from one of our senior most journalists.